Hi everyone and welcome to Triple M Adventures with Bill. Before we get started, please consider subscribing to my channel and possibly becoming a Patreon. In this video, it's part of a series that I'm doing of the Toolkit RC products where I'm comparing them. And we're going to have a look today at the inputs that you can put into them so that you can input P PWM, PPM and SBUS signals so that you can test your receivers. Now you can use the M8S or the M6 or the M7 or the ST8 servo checker to do this. So let's uh, switch over to the overhead camera and I will show you how to do this. Okay, let's do the test with the M6 first. Let's plug our power in and then we plug our receiver in with um, ground at the top. There you go, you can hear my radio pick up the receiver. So now we're going to go to measure. Push OK. We're going to go across to S bus. And now you can, if you can see that screen, which I hopefully you can, and if I move the sticks, we can test the S bus signals are correct on my four channels. There we go, that's the test on the M6. Now let me show you on the M7. We're going to plug in. And turn the power on. And here it's slightly different. We have an input and an output uh, for the S bus signals. So we need to make sure we put it on the first one and with ground at the top. There we go. There you go, it's connected to my radio. Now we long press the exit button and we say measure signal. And we can then choose S bus there. And now if I move the sticks, you can see. Okay, that's great, there we go. And you can see, we can see our signals, make sure they're correct. Now let's do it on the M8S. Let's put power to our charger. There we go. And this time we plug into this side and it goes that way. Okay, there we go, it's connected to our radio. Let's put this down here. And we're gonna to go to measure, we're gonna to go to S bus, and there we go, we can test again. So there you can see, you can see all the channels working. So that's the MA test, and the final one is the ST8. So let's just exit out of here. Now let's do it on the ST8. We're gonna put the power into it. There we go, and we now go into port S5, this way around. Right, now we press the wheel here, and we connect, we say S bus, and we exit. There we go, push exit, and now we can see our channels working. Channel one, two, three, and four. There we go. Thanks for watching this video. And if you found it interesting, please give it a thumbs up. And if you have any comments or questions, please leave them in the comment section because I would love to hear from you. Thanks for watching. Happy flying. Bye for now.